Hey there, my little pretties. What is up? It's your mistress, the Shao Linus here. And today we're doing, yet again, another discussion video. And today we're doing a discussion video on another reboot that I really did not don't like. And that, my little pretties, you're asking is the Ben 10 reboot. Why I dislike the Ben 10 reboot net series. Now, let's get on with, you know, Ben 10, if I like it or not. Now, first of all, let's say... I have watched the original Ben 10, you know, that ran from 2005 to 2008 or 9. That show was actually really good. That was when I liked Ben 10 then. I still do. The original. But here's one thing that I could really say. It had, like, too many reboots. Like, I don't understand why Cartoon Network think it's a good idea to reboot these shows. Well, I could explain this. Alien Force or Ultimate Force or whatever you prefer to call it. I know it features Ben 10, you know, looking, like, a little older or that. But I could definitely say that reboot was actually okay. It's pretty decent. I've seen some episodes that were decent, but still. Another reboot that I'm going to explain, and this is something, is the Omniverse. Now, I don't care for the Omniverse. Some episodes are pretty decent. But I didn't really watch too much of it, because I don't care about it. But here's the reboot that we're going to, you know, do a discussion on and why I dislike. The Ben 10 Reboot Series. This has been around since 2016. And oh my beeping god. What the hell is this? Now I know you've probably seen this in the thumbnail. Probably recommended to you. You know, this video probably got recommended to you. For those who have subscribed and ring the bell. But let's face it. This story of of its own self, was not good. Well, not the story, but this reboot of, you know, Ben 10. The animation's terrible. The episodes are nothing original. Well, even though they probably, you know, use some of it from the original other episodes. But here's one thing. They're not providing anything new. They're just copying, you know, almost every episode. Like I said with Teen Titans Go, here's something I'm going to say with the Ben 10 reboot. Why did Cartoon Network think this was a great idea? I don't understand why Cartoon Network think it's a great idea to reboot these shows. But most of these reboots are just... I don't even know why. But here's one thing. Why do Cartoon Network think it's a good idea to reboot any of these? Why do they think it's a great idea? I don't understand why, you know, why they would sit there and, you know, continuously... the do these reboots. Why did Cartoon Network think it's a great idea to do this with Teen Titans? Make Teen Titans Go. Well, if you saw my last episode, why I don't like Teen Titans Go, I highly recommend you go check that out on my channel. But now, today, this is the Ben 10 reboot series. I don't like the Ben 10 reboot series. Why is it the case, you may be asking? Well, I could say I've watched maybe a few episodes of it, maybe two or three, and then I was like, okay, I can't watch anymore. One of the reasons being that the animating, the animation of this is just not that great. Like, I like the original Ben 10, 10 um, animation. That one was actually really good. Of course, um, Alien Force is okay and decent animation. And the same thing will have to go to... Um, the Omniverse. The Omniverse one was actually decent. But with this reboot, the animation is like... Well, I'm going to be honest right now. It's just like these people were maybe... be. I'm going to say they're probably drunk and decide, Oh, let's reboot Ben 10. And they sit there and draw Ben 10 and all the characters like... If they were drawn by a three-year-old kid. Like... Why did Cartoon Network think this was a great idea? I'm afraid I'm not going to understand why Cartoon Network think this was a great idea. But let me be honest. A lot of people don't like the reboot of Ben 10. And I'm certainly one of those people that don't like the reboot of Ben 10. You know, kids out these days are watching it. I'm afraid there's no reason on why they're watching it. They watch it because it's really cool. Well, that's kids. But to us adults, I'm looking at it and I don't understand... Why is it the case that people have to sit there and, you know, come up with something, you know, not original when it comes to rebooting a show? Like with this show right here, 
I think there was a few episodes where Ben does, you know, turns into an alien and gets, you know, stuff, you know, you know, tries to survive, well, pretty much that, and even saves the world. You know, to be honest, I really never liked the alien animation of the aliens in the reboot as well. Like, the if I compare this one to the original, I have to say the original Ben 10 was actually really better Especially with the animation done with the aliens. They were better than the animations of the aliens that we got on here. I am going to be honest right now, people, that that if you like this show, that is fine. If you like this show, I respect your opinion. Like, if you like the reboot of Ben 10, I respect your opinion. But please respect my opinion, as I don't like this show. Now, the voice acting was not that great either. I'm not trying to sound rude, but it's actually the honest truth. But I could definitely say that, you know, the voice acting in this was not that great. You know, I'm afraid I don't understand why Cartoon Network think it's a great idea to, you know, do these kind of reboots. Because, you know, like I 17 Titans Go, Ben 10 in this one, that from what I did see, he's, he's acting like he's a whiny crybaby just like Caillou. I don't understand why he's acting like this in the reboot, because when you look at the original, he's acting like a ma like a mature, you know, teenager that can be immature sometimes. Oh, yeah. To be honest, though, Ben 10 can be immature mature most times, like in the original show, for those of you who've watched it as a kid. For those of you who have not seen the original uh, Ben 10 series, I highly recommend you sit there and watch it. You know, if you watch it, you will never, re you will not regret it. But unfortunately in here, I'm afraid this is something I'm going to probably get a lot of hate. But Cartoon Network should never have made Teen Titans Go or even the reboot of Ben 10. I don't understand why Cartoon Network think it's a great idea to, you know, remake these shows that we loved as a kid and make them as terrible as terrible can honestly be. I'm afraid I don't understand why this show is still existed. You know, the Ben 10... Ten episode, well, Ben 10 reboot series, I honestly only watched maybe two or three episodes and then I'm like, okay, I'm done. I can't even watch it because it's so horrible because it looks like a kid decided to sit there and, you know, draw it and then think, oh, it's actually really good. When in all due sincerity, it does not look any good at all. Like, I'm looking at the animation and it sucks. There's nothing ever thing good going for it. There was nothing going for it for even to begin with. Why is this show even still existed? Like, the reboot of the show, it's still ill-flipping existing. Like, I really hope this show gets cancelled, maybe in the near future. Because, you know, a lot of people really want the original Ben 10 to come back. I personally want the original Ben 10 to come back. Maybe have more seasons of it. You know, that would at least be a thousand times better than sitting there and looking at this garbage reboot. I'm afraid this is something I'm not going to understand. Don't ask why I won't understand. Because most of you guys probably will be in the same state as me. Why do Cartoon Network keep doing with these reboots? You know, I might make a separate video why I don't like these, these cartoon reboots need to stop. Which I'll probably, you know, well, bad ones actually. That might be a discussion video coming up relatively soon. I don't know when, but I know it will come up very soon. Now... If you compare this reboot of Ben 10 to the original Ben 10, there's lots of differences. Ben 10 actually looks, you know, really, really like a teenager. With all due sincerity, I know he's 10 years old, but the animation in this was, like, better. There was lots of good stuff and good, good episodes in that. You know, I enjoyed the original Ben 10 episodes, but when I watched two episodes of, you know, the Omniverse... I actually thought some of the episodes were decent. And Alien Force, I found the show to be pretty nice as well. Even though it's a, not really a reboot, but still. Why did Cartoon Network have to sit there and, you know, have this show on the air as much as Teen Titans Go? I'm afraid that's a question I might not be able to have an answer for it. But here's something I'm going to be honest. The reboot of Ben 10, it just needs to end and been take, be take off the air. Like, it needs to be cancelled or something. Because in that way, we can at least, you know, have better shows. 
I'm afraid there's something I will not understand is, you know, why does this show even exist? I'm just trying to be honest right here, people. When I watched this, uh, well, reboot, when, when it came on TV one time, I, like I said, I couldn't watch it anymore. It was just that bad. Like... I don't understand why Cartoon Network think this is a great idea. Well, like, the animation's not that great. The voice acting was mainly not good. Because, well, the original voice actors from, you know, the... Well, basically from... From the original Bed 10, the voice acting was pretty good. But in this reboot, it's just not as great as I hoped. It's not good as I was hoping. I thought this reboot was actually going to be something really decent or good. But nope. It just went down the same path like uh, Teen Titans Go did. The same path that Teen Titans Go did. And the Powerpuff Girls reboot actually went down that path too. Like, to be honest, I don't like this show. Why am I ranting? not ranting. I'm not ranting on it. Well, kind of am, but mainly it's a discussion. Like, the animation in, you know, the Ben 10 reboot is just not that good. Like, it's like all these Ben 10 characters are, like, drawn, like, by two-year-olds. Like, I'm not trying to sound rude, but it's the truth. Like, Ben 10 and the aliens look like they've been drawn by, like, kids. I don't understand why they look like they've been drawn by a two-year-old kid or something. Or three-year-old kids, for that matter. I don't get it why that's the case. Why... Why does this reboot even exist to even begin with? Like, who thought this was a great idea? I am afraid that's the same thing with, like, the Teen Titans Go reboot. I am not going to understand. I am tired of, you know, Cartoon Network coming up with these reboots, thinking, oh, it's a good idea. Oh, derp, 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 derp. let's do this. And then they go ahead and, you know, do the reboot, you know, make animations of that. And then people look at it, and they're like, bashing it and be like, what the hell is this? Why are we getting this piece of crap? Why are we not getting the good crap that we grew up with as a kid or that my kid likes or something? Why, 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 why? <sighs> why do people do this? Like, why do people do this when it comes to cartoon reboots? I'm afraid that that is something I will not, under not understand. I am... <sighs> I'm sorry, people. But, you know, Cartoon Network now these days... The shows are boring, not good, and even they're just repetitive. Like, what I mean by repetitive is, like, they're almost, you know, copying the exact same episode that's happened in, you know, the original show. Why are Cartoon Network thought that was a great idea as well with Teen Titans Go and even the Powerpuff Girls? I'm afraid that's a question that is going to be left unanswered unless somebody can have a good explanation on why it's there. This show is a 0 out of 10 for me. The reboot of Ben 10, I give it a 0 out of 10. It's not good. Nothing was ever good about this story. Well, the show. Like, the show, I'm afraid there is a question that it's going to leave unanswered as well. How come Cartoon Network is not coming up with newer shows? Or even having more seasons of it or something? But why do people sit there and, you know, continuously... Decide to think this was a great idea. That is just a question that I'm not going to, you know, have answered. Unless someone has a really good explanation. Like, okay, I'm kind of like running out of words for me to describe the show. I think you should already know why I dislike this show. But anyways, guys, what do you think of my discussion video? Do you agree with me? Do you not? If you think I'm missing some information, just comment down below and I will have an answer for you. And also. If you like this show, like the Ben 10 reboot, if you like this reboot of Ben 10, that is fine. I am not going to criticize. I will not criticize you if you like the show. If you like the show, that's fine. But please respect my opinion as I didn't don't like the show. Anyways, people, thank you for watching my discussion video. I'm the Shadow Linus. Thank you so much for watching. And like always, I'll be out. So see you all later.